Hello students, how are you all? Hope you are doing well. I am Shweta and welcome to the maths class of standard 3. I am teaching chapter number 4, multiplication. And this is video number 3 of this chapter. So, till last video, we already have learned how to multiply 3 digit number by 1 digit number. Okay? Now, in this video, we will learn to multiply 3 digit number by 2 digit number. Okay? I have already written here a problem. Multiply 312 by 21. So, let us start now. First, what I have to do? First, I have to arrange these numbers according, according to their places. Okay? As this number is of 3 digits, so we have to write 3 different places. Okay? 1's, 10's, 100's. Okay? 3 different places I have written. Now, we have to arrange these numbers according to their places. Okay? 312. In this number, 3 is placed at 100 position. 1 is placed at 10th position and 2 is placed at 1's position. Okay? Arrange the first number according to their places. Now, the second number by which we have to multiply. Okay? This is of 2 digit number. So, we also have to arrange these number according to their places. Okay? So, in this 21, 1 is placed at 1's position. And this 2 is placed at 10th position. Okay? Then keep the multiplication sign. Now, how we have to multiply this number? Just forget right now about this second number. With this number, as we already have learned to multiply any number by one digit number, we will start our multiplication by this number. Okay? Just right now forget about this number. First, I have, I will multiply 1 by the 1's place, then 10's place and after that 100 place. Okay? So, 1 twos are 2, 1 ones are 1 and 1 threes are 3. Okay? So, this multiplication done. Now what we have to do? This is done. We have multiplied by this number. We have to multiply by this number. The second number. Okay. How we will multiply? First, like we have already done with this number. Similarly like that, we have to also start our multiplication by 1's place. Okay. This number first will be multiplied by 1's place. Then 10's place and after that, Place. Okay? So, start multiplication. 2 twos are 4. Okay? 2 twos are 4. But where should I write the 4? This number is at 10th position and this number is at 1's position. Okay? So, remember that from which place we are starting our multiplication we have to write the number, the answer that we get after multiplication just below of that place. Like from this number, this number was placed at 1's position. So when we started our multiplication, we started our writing from 1's place. Okay. So if we are now multiplying at 10's position, so we will start our writing from 10's place. Means this 4 we have to write here. Okay. Then what we have to write at here, at this place, because we are write, started our writing from 10th place, then we have to give 0 at 1's place. Now why? This 2 is placed at 10th position. 2, 10. 2, 10 is equal to 20. 1, 10 is equal to 10. 2, 10 is equal to 20. 3, 10 is equal to 30. So, 2 times is equal to 20. So, if I am multiplying 20, this 2 times is equal to 20. 20 by 2. 
if I will multiply 20 by 2, then result we will get 40. Okay? So, 40 as you can written here. Understood this? Now, what I have to do? 2 ones are 2. Okay? But, I cannot write my answer at tens place. Because already I have written at tens place. So, I will just jump to the next higher place. That is, that is hundreds place. So, 2 ones are 2. I will write at hundreds place. Okay? Now, this one done. This one done. Okay? Now, I have to start my multiplication to this place. Okay? This 2, I have to multiply at hundreds place. Okay? So, 2 3s are 6. Okay? So, 6, I cannot write here because I already have written a digit here, a number here. So, I have to make a new place that is just higher to the right side of the place. Okay? After 100, Okay, so now we will write 2 3s are 6 at 1000 place. Okay, now multiplication by both the numbers done. So as you can see here there are two different sets of number. Okay, and in each number two numbers are placed at a same place. Like at one's place, two different numbers are placed. At tens position also, two different numbers are placed. At hundred place also, two different numbers are placed. And at thousand place, one number is placed. Okay? So, to find out the product, what we have to do? We have to add these two number according to their places. Means, in this number, two is placed at one's position. In this number, 0 is placed at 1's position. So, we have to add these two numbers which is which are placed at 1's position. The number that are placed at 10's position, the numbers that are placed at 100th position and the number that is placed at 1000th position. Okay? So, we have to keep the addition sign. Okay? Now, 2 plus 0, 2. Okay, 4 plus 1, 5, 2 plus 3, 5 and 6, we have to write as it is because nothing is written over there. Okay, now we have added the sets of number according to their places and the number that we got after addition of these two numbers is the product of these two factors. So hope this is clear to you. So just pause this video and write these things in your hands notebook. Now let us take an another example. Okay, here I have written already arranged the numbers according to their places. Okay, now we have to start our multiplication from this number. The number that is placed at one's position. Okay? Just forget about the second number right now. 4, 6 are 24. Okay? So, from 24, we have to write this 4. Because this 4 is at one's place. And this 2 is at tens place. This 2 will be carried forward to tens place. Because this 2 is at tens position. Okay? Now, multiplication with this number done. Now, we have to multiply this number with this number. That is placed at tens position. Okay. 4 ones are 4. 4 ones are 4. And then we have to add 2. That is already carry over here. Okay. 4 ones are 4. 4 plus 2, 6. Then we will write here 6. Okay. Now this number also done. We have multiplied. Now we have to multiply this number by the number that is placed at 100th position. 4 3s are 12. Okay. 4 3s are 12. So we will write this 2 at 
100 position and 1 we have to write at a new place 1000 position. Okay. Now multiplication by this number completed. Okay. Now just forget about this number and we have to multiply by the second number. Okay. The same way first way we have to multiply by 1's position then tens position and after that hundred position. Okay. So two six ja two six ja twelve. Two six ja twelve. Okay. But we have started our uh, multiplication from tens place. So we will write this two at tens place. Okay. And we will give a zero at ones place. Okay. After that, this one will be carried forward to this place. Just now remove this two because it is already added. Now we have to carry forward one to this place. Okay. Now two ones are two. Two ones are two. Two plus one, three. Okay. So now we will write this three at one higher place. Okay. Now multiplication to this number also completed. Now we have to multiply this number by the number that is placed at 100th position. Okay. Now 2 3 is a 6. 2 3 is a 6. So we will write that the new place that is 1000th place. Why? Because we already have written at 100th place. So we cannot write at 100th place. Okay. Now what we have to do? Two sets of number are there. And in each place, two, two different numbers are placed. At once, two different number. Tens, two different number. Hundreds, two different number. And at thousand also, two different numbers. Okay? So we will just add these number to find out the accurate number. 4 plus 0. 4. 2 plus 6. 8. 3 plus 2, 5 and 6 plus 1, 7. Okay, so this number we got after addition of these two different numbers that we have got by multiplication of these two digit number. Okay, now just remove this also because it is already added. Okay. Now, this is the product of these two factors. Okay? So, just pause this video and write this example also in your maths notebook.